Hi all, in this video, I'll be showing you as to how you can set up a split URL test. Let me click on create from the split URL dashboard. Setting up a split URL test in VW is basically a three-step process. You need to initialize the URL of the pages that you want to test out. Then you need to link your tests to goals. Only with the help of goals, you can figure out your visitors' interaction with your control and the variation. Then you need to finalize the test and then make it live. So let's specify the URL of the pages that we want to test out. For example, let's say I want to test out different variations of my home page under the split URL testing. The control basically represents your original URL. The variation URL would be the newly hosted page that is lying on a different URL altogether. So let's assume that we have different variation URLs that we have hosted from our end. You simply have to specify those URLs under the variation input box. Now, when the visitor lands on the control, VW will decide if they are going to see the control or would they be redirected to the variations. You can test out any number of variations under the split URL testing. Split URL testing is nothing but a redirection test where we distribute your audience and we figure out which one performs the best. You can also use the segmentation option that is available under the more options to enable any targeting conditions for your audience. So once you have initialized the URL of the pages, you can go ahead and link your tests to goals. There's no restrictions on the number of goals that you can track inside a test campaign. Once you have specified the type of goal that you want to link to the test, you can click on next and navigate to the final step. You can decide the percentage of traffic that you want to include in the campaign. So for example, if I go with 50%, then only if the 50 percentage of the traffic that lands on the control URL will be included in my campaign. And VW will split this 50% equally between the control and the variations. You also have the option of customizing the traffic between the variations. You can go ahead and specify any options that you want under the advanced options according to your use case. I'll go ahead and rename my test as well. Once you have finalized all the settings, you can then go ahead and click on Create. Please note that if there's any error in the variation URLs or if the page that you have hosted times out or does not exist, then VW will start redirecting your visitors to a 404 not found error. So please ensure that you have previewed all the changes before you go ahead and start your campaign. Thank you for watching.